Hi friends, uh, here is another problem of arithmetic progression related to Anthem formula. Question is saying here, yeah, how many multiples of 4 lie between the 10 and 250, right? So, uh, these are the two critical points, right? Between 10 and 250, right? And all the numbers should be multiple of 4, just like 8, right? 4, uh, so it will start from the first multiples of 4 between 10 and 250 is 12, right? 10 cannot be divided by 4, 11 cannot be divided by 4, so 12 is the first point, right? So, uh, uh, let me do here. The first multiple uh, of 4 between the 10 and 250 is 12, and then another is 16, another is 20, right? And so on, so on, right? Up to it should be 250, but 250 is not divisible by 4, right? Uh, because this 50 cannot be divisible by f uh, uh, 50 is not divisible by 4. So the another f uh, divisible number that is just closer to the 50 and less than 50 is 48, right? So 48 is divisible by this. Uh, this both we used to uh, use this. We used to see the first term and the this second digit right first digit and second digit it's 48 so 48 divisible by 4 so 248 is the last digit divisible by 4 or multiple of 4 right multiple of 4 between the 10 and 25 250 right so 248 244 and like this right so this is our series right or we can say sequence this is our sequence between uh, 10 to 250 and those numbers these are those numbers which are multiples of 4 so here our first term is 12 right the common difference is of course all numbers are divisible by 4 that's why it will be 4 of course the common difference right the common difference is 4 right uh, if you want to write then you can write also 16 minus 12 is equals to 4 right and the last term right the last term here is 248 this 248 so 248 is the last term and which term we don't know it may be 100th term it may be 60th term it may be 70th term it may be 55th term or which may be which may i don't know but we need to find out that number right we need to find out the that number means that must term is 248 so this and we need to find out right so again i'm using the same formula as usual i we used to do right uh, that's a uh, n term formula a n equals to a plus n minus 1 times common difference right so here a n the nth term is 248 and the first term is 12 and n minus 1 n is not uh, given so n minus 1 that we need to find out then n we need to find out the common difference is for or 248 minus this 12 right is equals to n minus 1 times 4 or what I can write 4 n minus 1 right n minus 1 is equals to 248 minus 12 so it is 236 right 8 minus 2 that is 6 4 minus 1 that is 3 right and 2 minus 1 uh, uh, 2 minus 1 that is uh, sorry uh, there, there is nothing so simply it's 236 right so further what I can write that n minus 1 is equals to 236 divided by 4 right so 4 5 ja 20 and then 3 6 4 4 9 ja 36 so it is 59 therefore n equals to 59 plus 1 that is 60 yeah so what we knew now knew now that there are 60 number of terms between the 10 to 250 which all are the multiples of 4 right the multiple of 4s between 10 and 250 are 60 there are 60 such terms 60 such numbers which are multiple of 4 so like this we need to find out generally in this type of problem what we have to do we have to first see the first term right what is our the first term and what is our last term then using the nth term formula for the last term we will be getting the value of the n and means the total number of terms uh, which are uh, similar to that right uh, according to the questions so how many such numbers are there means the total number of terms in that particular series we will get right so like this we have to find out such problems and next video we'll be doing a little bit different problem of the same uh, nth term formula and hope uh, you'll be following us okay uh, uh, in uh, our skyingblogger.com because i have listed there lots of problems related to the, this right so you'll be boosting your knowledge over there 
uh hope uh, we'll be meeting in the next video bye